So I'm on an on-ramp, and I'm curious if it puts the blinker on. I don't think it will. And uh, it doesn't. So you need to put your blinker on to let people know on your on-ramps. turn pretty slow. Okay, so let's see how we do here. Uh, again, uh, merging in it does not turn on your blinker. Um, it's funny because when you exit up the highway, it automatically turns your blinker on and actually steers. Going on a highway, it steers or merges in, but it does not put on your blinker. That's a uh, potential mistake. You should really turn on the blinker for you. you must know that you're merging. Corruption here, so I'm going to just drive by hand until I get closer. And then now I can turn it on safely. Gets over here. Didn't go over, so that was a double lane entrance ramp, and it basically cut off the uh, person in the right lane because it just kept going straight. I don't know whether uh, double lane entrance uh, knows to shuffle over at the right time. I've noticed the on ramps, it just seems to always go to the end of the on ramp and looks for, I guess, the main line cutting over to the left in this case and uh, uh, then starts turning uh, for the merge. I guess it doesn't go by GPS positional information. Here we've got some merge traffic on the right. Let's see what it does. It's slowing down. That's pretty cool to let this uh, car in. That was nice. I've been wondering about merge Merging traffic. So you handle that fairly well. Thanks for watching. If you want to see some of my other Model 3 videos, they're here in the top right. I just created a new channel, Nick's Pickleball Life, for my pickleball adventures. The name's weird, but the game is great, and you can find games virtually everywhere. If you want six months of free supercharging, please use my referral code listed on the bottom left. My Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram accounts are listed on the bottom right. And please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends. Thanks, everyone. Bye-bye.